I'm out in uh, Sunnyvale, California, and this is the company that makes the DaVinci robotic system. Uh, I'm part of a focus group on creating awareness for uh, hysterectomy cancers and for prostate cancers. And one of the cool things besides that, we actually get to uh, see how the DaVinci robotic system works. I, of course, was asleep when all that happened, so this is kind of cool. There's really just two things you need to do. You have to be able to see it, and you have to be able to use your hands to move the instruments. So to see the image, and actually, Jim, I'm going to raise this up a little so your back can be nice and straight. There we go. Um, you have to have your head inside of the viewer because the system knows if your head's out and won't let you move the instruments for safety. So with your head in, you'll take control of these two hand controls here. And you can pull your head out, Jim, so you can see these. But you're going to use either your thumb and index or thumb and middle finger and just place them inside the straps. And it's a very light, delicate touch with the instruments when you move them. So to actually tell the system you're ready to work, you have to pinch and release your fingers to engage the instruments. And that's all there is to it. At that point, you can move the instruments wherever you'd like. So let me see if the... Uh, Okay, so, Jim, it looks like your left hand should move. Oh, perfect. Now, with your right hand, just loosen your hold so it's nice and delicate. A nice light hold. Oh, Jim, look, hey, good job. All depends on the procedure you're doing. Oh, I see, okay. So, um... I could certainly have used something like that when I was preparing for the surgery. Yeah. Yeah. That actually works. And you can move them wherever you want in the field. So you can. Oh, God, Did you want to grab any of those things? I can move So sterilization. Um, this system actually has drapes that go on during surgery. These arms are normally all draped out, and the drapes are clean, disposable, single use items. So they're draped all yeah. over, all of that. So after every surgery, they take the drapes off, put new ones on. And that's an extra water. <laughs> uh, yeah, and the system actually is intelligent. It knows if you're trying to cheat. All right, here we go. This should be like flying airplanes. Yeah. Right, so yeah, this, um, so then you're probably familiar with, this is the piece that actually attaches to the patient, that's the surgery. Yeah. And then, um, this piece here is what actually, um, creates the 3D vision, so it can the image, um, among a bunch of other things. And then, right here is where the surgeon actually sits and uses the instruments. Yeah. And it's really depends on intuitive. It's, it's natural. I got to tell you, that was really cool, and I can see how the surgeons pick up on it uh, so quickly and how precise it is for the surgery. So uh, I'm going to make another pitch that if you're a guy out there, uh, you have your PSA level checked. Uh, if you're a wife of a husband, boy, girlfriend, boyfriend, whatever, you have the guy, get to the doctor, get it checked uh, so that this is an option for him.